Well, definitely don't want to go that way then. How's it going guys and welcome to The Last Door Chapter 1. This is a free to play game. A free to play. Ugh, man. This is a free game on congregate.com. You can play it. There's uh, like four chapters I do believe. It's like a horror point and click uh, pixel art style game. It's really really good. I've played it before. I haven't played it in years though so I want to go back and try it again. Uh, you can uh, play it for yourself for free or you can actually get um, uh, a paid version which isn't that much and you can help support the developer and it, let's try this out new game after all the things I've seen what's this? picked up the rope uh pick up a chair after all the things I've done uh, but the my life is on a course that I can't escape from oh looks like the guy's gonna hang himself it's too late for me now stand on the chair I just hope you could forgive me someday. Yours sincerely, Anthony Beechworth. Oh, he's fucking hanging himself. That is a great start to a game. The last door. October 1891 Skype I'm guessing that's French I don't know That's the only thing my dear old friend Anthony Beechworth wrote in his letter it had been many years since I last heard that sentence. It used to be the motto of the science and philosophy group that we secretly ran back when we were in the secluded boarding school in Scotland. We left it all behind, like simple childhood memories. But it was unusual. That letter could only mean something awful must have happened. Something that must remain absolutely secret. I had to find out what was going on. Without delay, I took the first morning train to Sussex to address to the address on the letter. And there it was, the old home of Anthony's family, the Beechworth Mansion. Ooh, the Beechworth. Chapter 1, The Letter. Okay, so here we are. Can I move? Oh, I can click. Point click. Let's go in first. This is weird. Everything is silent. Like there's no one living here. I'm worried about Anthony. I have to find him. Oh, I had to take off my jacket first. The music is so creepy. A grandfather clock. It's the only sound around here. So, what, what do we got here? A picture? A portrait of Anthony. He looks older than I expected. Okay. My coat. Good to know. <laughs> uh, what's this? A note on the table. Dear Mi Mr. Beechworth, Due to recent events, the situation has become unbearable for us, and much to our regret, we have no other choice but to leave. We will remain forever grateful for all these years at your service. God bless you, Mr. and Mrs. Brewer. So, I guess he had people working for him that just didn't want to take it no more. I can go this way or this way. Let's go this way. 
And it's... Nah, those are some nice sounds. Can I go in here? It won't open. Can I go? Can I go this way? It's too dark. I can't go any farther. Okay, I can't go that way. So. All right. What do we got here? A gramophone. It looks rusty. What's this? A drinks cabinet with glasses, some crystal bottles, and a matchbox. Can I take the matchbox? Only these matches could be useful. Okay, good enough. What else? A fireplace. Looks like it hasn't been cleaned in a long time. Can I use the matches in here? I don't need to light up the fireplace. Well, why not? Damn it. That large window is wide open, letting the cold dusk air in. Can I close it? No? Okay. Can I open this? Oh, I can open this. Go down the hallway and into this. Uh, what's this? A variety of cooking ingredients. This? The kitchen stove and a cleaning cloth. Well, I'll take the cleaning cloth, right? Yes. Okay, old cloth. Plates and pans. Anything else? Oh, a plate with some day-old leftovers. Mmm, yummy. Anything else? No? Can I go here? I unlocked the door. Uh, what the hell are those things? That, it's just rubbish. Rubbish! A murder of crows is eagerly, eagerly eating something. Well, definitely don't want to go that way then. Okay, back at the front. Uh, I haven't finished here, so... So an old cloth. Uh, can I go this way? Yes, I can. A crooked painting. On crooked it. It's still crooked. That did something. Oops. An old rosary with a solid wood crucifix. I'll take that. A landscape painting. A landscape painting. Okay, he likes his landscape paintings, I guess. Okay. Some toiletries. Some toiletries. A lamp. It will come in handy. Take that. Take the lamp! There's nothing of interest in these drawers. Except drawers, underpants, an empty bowl. Like the ones used to feed a pet. So obviously they had a pet. March 5th, 1891. Master made us get rid of our religious objects. What is going on with him? Luckily, I found a place to hide my rosary. I can't pray every night without it. May 18th, 1891. Master has been complaining about Alfie. What would a simple cat do to him? He ordered us to keep him out of the house at all times. Still, I can't let that poor thing starve. He's such a clever cat. Every time I open the window, he knows food is waiting for him. Anyway, I'm worried about the master. He's growing more and more unlike himself every day. September 5th, 1891. Mr. Beechworth is spending whole days locked inside his office. He wants us to leave him food at the door, but he barely eats anything. I'm really worried. So he was going crazy, apparently? That's my guess. So, oh. A small plant brings some life to this place. Okay. Open the door. Uh, it's padlocked. Okay. So, go this. Oh, no. This way. So, I got matches, old cloth, a rosary, an unlit lamp. Well, I can light the lamp with the matches, or I should be able to anyway. Okay, there's nothing here. Go back this way. Uh, yes, go this way. 
go this way and light matches. Ah, there we go. Now I can go this way. <laughs> Walking in the darkness. What the hell is this? Some wooden planks have been nailed to this doorway. Okay. That's not spooky or anything. Oh, oh. Looks like some of the paintings are missing. Uh, yeah. Okay. A double bed. It's covered in dust. Seems like no one has slept here for days. <laughs> covered in dust in his uh, only days? A gentleman with a serious and inquisitive look. A fireplace hasn't been used for a long time. What to do over here? This window leads to a balcony that communicates with an adjacent room. Can I open it? I can't open the latch. It's stuck. Perhaps I could force it with a small tool. Your head. Family portraits. Okay. Let's keep going this way. Oh, there's a door right here. And it's locked with a key. Of course it is. Stupid locks. Come on there, dude. Walk faster. For it being pixel art, they put a lot of like time and effort into the atmosphere of the game. It's really cool. Oh, can I go upstairs? Oh, that is up the stairs. Was that up the stairs? Okay, won't open. Can I go that way? Oh, it's the same thing. Okay, so... Where can I go now? Old cloth. Can I use old cloth on this? Despite the rust. So it's in good condition despite the rust. Oop. Can I put that in there? Clean the fires will be useless. Okay. Um. So. Is there anything in here? Kitchen stoves. Old cloth. No? No? Oh. What was that? I'd rather not clean it. Plate with some old leftovers. Can I pick it up? No? Okay. Can I go this way? <laughs> They're too vicious. Getting too close would be dangerous. Um, can I go here? No? Okay. Can I go this way? <laughs> can I go this way? Oh, wait. What was this? No, wait. That's just going back the other way. I don't want to go back the other way. Oh. The field surrounding the house stretches majestically as far as the eye can see. I didn't know Anthony was the owner of such properties. Okay, so. We have the crucifix. Oh. No, that just takes us over here. Trick cabinet with glasses. Can I use on that? No. Um, can I close the window? No? No? Okay. Back in here, I guess. So, I need a tool to go up the other way. Um... Can't, I have no food there. Oh, what's this? There's a tiny dark hole in the wall. No, I can't use it. I got an old cloth. No. Can I burn it? No. Okay. Oh. No. Oh, there it is. I, I'll keep the rosary with me better than leaving it here on the wall. Oh, oh. In the wall, I can see a trace of a crucifix that was hanging there for years, and now it's gone. Can I open the window? It won't stay open. It looks like the the wood is giving up. 
I need some sort of cord to keep it open. There. The rosary will keep the window open. Aha! An empty bowl. Okay. What else can I do? I need, like, food or something. No, oh, it's locked. Nothing? Okay. Alright, we'll go back this way. So, there's paintings, lots of paintings. That's where I came from. That's this area. Cooking ingredients. Old food. No, doesn't seem to really be a whole lot in here. And I can't, there's nothing back here. Can I go... Okay, that just takes me this way. So, can I do this? No. Okay. Can I do this? No, I can't. Can I throw a match at him? <laughs> no, I can't. Alright. Um, back inside. Back here. Back here. Is there anything else I can do? It hasn't been cleaned in a long time. Oop. Cleaning the fireplace would be useless. Okay. Dusk air in. So. Hmm? What did I say? There's no record on the, gram the gramophone. A stuffed deer head. So I need a record. Can't. A record for this. Uh, what else do I need? No, can't stop it. Can I wipe that? No. Nope. There was a. Uh... Oop. Won't open. Okay. As I go through here, I'm going to figure out what the hell I'm supposed to do. Okay, I need, like, a hammer or something for that. Old cloth. No? Oh. Cleaning the fires would be useless. Oh. A silver key? Oh, damn right I'll take that. There's a padlock somewhere. Where was the padlock? It wasn't here. There was a, I need a tool for that. Um, the padlock somewhere. Where was the padlock? Was it this one? No, okay. That's not padlocked. It must be this way. This way? Um, this way? No. This way, and then this way. Aha, it has to be this way. <laughs> I don't know, bro! <laughs> right to the very end of the hallway. There. Here's the key. Aha! Oh, I don't like that sound. A slate record titled The Carnival of Ven Venice. Can I take it? Oh, yeah. There I go. I got a record. What the hell? Some firewood. Can I take it? Can I light it? No? An iron crowbar. I'll take that. Some firewood. No? Okay. What's this? The cement is still fresh in this wall. Use a crowbar on it. Can't break down the wall with this. Alright then. Light. No? Okay. Go away. Go away, thing. Matches. I don't need to light the boiler. The boiler looks like it's been out of use for a long time. Okay. Go all the way back this way. So we got a crowbar to open 
the window, and we have a record to put on the grandma grandma my phone. <laughs> um, okay, so there's nothing in here yet. Let's go back to the main hall. Here it is. Record. Put that on there. Now there's a record on the gramophone. That's some awful music. What the hell? It must be broken. I don't know how to make it stop. Oh, so awful. <laughs> oh, the music stopped abruptly. What? What the hell? Holy shit. I think I'll just leave. <laughs> I'm not going to go back to that room. Thank you. <laughs> No, without scaring the shit out of myself. What the hell was that? The whole place was like full of like crows. Okay, we'll go here. Use the crowbar on this. What do you mean? Doesn't work. Doesn't work on this? Well, what the hell is a crowbar for? Oh, this right here. There. All right, time to go in. Uh, leave me alone. For God's sake, what happened here? It's a letter. Dear Margaret, it's been days since Anthony left his office. I can hear him whisper angrily, frightfully, and it gets worse at night. Our servants left a few days ago. Without their help and care, I'm lost. I can barely walk out of bed. Walk out of bed? Okay. Well, that's how it is. Not even the doctor would come here after his argument with Anthony. He has developed this horrible ability to break anyone's will. I don't know what to do. I don't have any strength left. I wish I could send you this letter. Your dear friend. Okay. Apparently the guy is going completely bonkers. A letter in a feeble handwriting I can't go on all is lost okay well, this one a diary page I can't stand their stares they watch me they judge me they despise me I know they think it, I'm not worth uh, worthy of this family who are they but dusk and bones a memory leave me I don't need you leave me alone Right. Ah, oh, I didn't even see her. The lifeless body of a woman. It's been here for a few days. She looks like she's clutching a note in her hand. I'm writing what will surely be my final thoughts, my last lines, my last breath. I don't know what kind of dark power has turned my husband into what he is now. A stranger. Uh, with a look bereft of all sanity, compassion, and human warmth. I don't know that shadow that slowly darkened our lives. I don't know this foreign host that now dwell in our souls. I don't know where it's from, but I'm sure it's not from this world. I will meet my brothers and sisters soon. I will be free from this abyss of madness and fear. Soon I will stop trembling. Okay, what the hell was that? A hairpin. Okay. An old wheelchair. Can I use it? Hmm. Nothing of interest in the dressing. What is this? The writing on the walls reads, Leave me alone. Who would have written such a thing? Anything else? No? Okay. Go in here. An adult woman. She looks really pale. 
young, a young Anthony, just like I remember him. An old, a woman holding a baby. She looks happy. An old, severe looking man. His gaze unsettles me. A teenage girl. She has a sad face. A young man. One of Anthony's relatives. Okay, we'll walk, out of, we'll walk over for this one. A portrait of Anthony with a stuffed lynx. It looks like he's very proud of his value, valued animal. The paint looks fresher around the lynx's head. Swipe it off. That would just spread out the fr uh, fresh paint. Okay. Can I do anything? No? No, nothing? Okay. Can I burn it? No? <laughs> There's a crow behind the window. It looks like it's trying to get in. Oh, that's always nice. Okay, got to uh, go in here and use the hairpin on this. I managed to open the latch. Oh, we're in somewhere. All right there, guys. I'm going to leave this video here. If you like the video, click the like and subscribe button. And if you want to play it, go. it's, it's free to play. Go on uh, congregate.com. They have all four chapters, so you can play all four chapters of this game. This is just the first chapter of the four. So it's a really interesting game for being pixel art um, point and click. But anyway there, guys, till the next video, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.